Okay, hello everyone and welcome back to The Binding of Isaac. Well, welcome back. It's always like several months between episodes with The Binding of Isaac. Hold on, let me just turn down the game a little bit more. The reason I'm recording this is because I probably mentioned this, but I'm currently abroad on holiday. And you know, I wanted to make some games and upload some videos when I'm gone. And you know, I didn't want to start like a series or anything because simply put, a whole like series wouldn't fit into these six days so instead I thought I would go ahead and do some miscellaneous uh, miscellaneous games you know games that I'm currently playing games that I'm finding fun and Binding of Isaac is always always a classic and as you probably saw by my initial streak I'm not currently the best Isaac player in the world uh, I only started well, I only picked the game back up again, like, literally today. So that negative 4 streak is from previous attempts. I don't know what the hell I was doing. I think I was going stuff on hard mode. You know, hard mode... That can be a bitch. I'm not gonna lie. And we... Oh, shit. Samson's ball and chain, I kinda hate this item, but... Whatever. At this point. We can break rocks with it. I think it can be used to block shots. So, hey, let's look at the positive side. Tinted rocks are going to be A-OK -okay from now on. Maybe this item isn't so bad. You can, like, use it to... Wait, is this the, not the one that you can swing around? I think it can damage enemies and block shots as well. It's worth breaking these, you know. For the odd coin or something. I think there's something with, with this item. Yeah. So, oh fuck, I ran into the fire. I ran into the fire twice, because I'm stupid. It's all good though. See, the only thing I'm hoping that I think I got going for me is that I have been playing a ton of Enter the Gungeon. And, you know, it's also a twin stick shooter. This is also a twin stick shooter, so... Hopefully I'm not as out of practice as... I seem. I probably am that out of practice, but hey, who cares? So yeah, that's the only thing that I kind of hate about Samson's Ball and Chain. It's very difficult to control. Oh, I could have rerolled. I just realized that I could have rerolled. Oh well, we have two rerolls for uh, this item in case we get something shit. Honestly, I'm not sure what I would take here in terms of an item that I'd be happy with. Health, I'm okay with. You know, Isaac, of course, starts with three health, so nothing wrong with that. But I... Oh, oh, fuck. But I'm not sure again, like, what... What would be ideal here. What I'm really worried about is the devil deals. Uh, spirit hearts... I haven't been able to get any, obviously. And, you know, the devil deal is always something that makes or breaks a run. By the way, uh, one of the things I'm looking forward to is Anti-Birth. When Anti-Birth comes out, I will definitely get back to... Is it called Anti-Birth? No, I always get it confused because Anti-Birth is the... Uh, the unofficial mod, but they're bringing it into like part of the official game. They're releasing it, and I had some news about it. But this is speed and that I'll take speed and damage any day. Yeah, I was gonna say the other thing I would very much appreciate is anything to increase my damage. I have zero coins. Ah, oh, the battery is here. That's a shame. Well, I have one coin, but you know what I mean. Practically zero. Okay, I really gotta gather my qualm for this next floor, because... Um, you know. One hit, and it's Adios Devil Deal. Which I would really disapprove of, personally. So yeah, once that comes out, the new DLC for this game, I will definitely bring back a more regular Isaac series because I always enjoy this game it's just I never find the time to like play it consistently you know uh, on screen 
I always mention this, my best friend, no thank you. Which one is that? I think that's like, oh shit. It's a slight damage down, but you know what, honestly, I'll take it, I'll take the piercing effect. Oh, look at that tiny monstro. That nearly just hit me. So, you know, technology I'm okay with. If you get more damage ups. I thought it was technology too for a second, but... I wouldn't be that lucky, honestly. So it's always about, again, finding a time to play this game consistently. Alright, man. Fuck it, let's go for the boss. Ragman. Okay, then it's actually fairly good that I got my... Uh, I got technology because of the piercing. Because this fool has homing shots, which I absolutely hate. It's very unpredictable. But I think we'll just stay nice and far away from him. You know, not risk... Oh, and that's a good item. That is a good item. All stats up. Giving us... Some shitty Devil Deal items. Gonna be honest with you, a little Brimstone I personally think is not worth uh, two hearts. And the other one, which I don't know the name of, it's some baby. Uh, I, I don't think that's worth what you call it as well. One heart even, that's a shitty item. That's the one where it like kind of delayed follows you and there's something with it like... If you get your shots through it, it increases its damage or something. Let's give it a shot. Nope. It was on the other... It's probably right here. Uh, apparently Samson's Ball and Chain cannot open secrets, which I forgot. Hey, better luck next time. I wish we could have gotten at least one Spirit Heart. And for this floor it would be very much appreciated. But hey, technology with its... We'll take that. Technology with its uh, infinite range. You know, I can't complain too much. Ooh. Oh, that was... I nearly got into big trouble there. Uh, sacrificial dagger. We'll take sacrificial dagger. I'm... I don't mind that item, honestly. Oh fuck, I think I touched... Mm. This is why I hate not having spirit hearts. One of the worst situations you could be in in this game is not having any spirit hearts. It absolutely sucks. Why did I even come in here? I do have nine. That battery would be nice to get. If I can somehow get myself up to 15 coins. The battery... The battery with D6 is... fairly overpowered. Giving you like... Oh, nice. Of course I get a spirit heart now. This game... Man, this game is a motherfucker. Let me just tell you that. It always gives you... the thing you want... right after you no longer need it. I swear this game is programmed that way. Use our infinite range. So I missed out on the devil deal anyways, so let's just go for Chad. Honestly, I'm not happy with Chad. I think it's... I don't think it's possible to reroll Chad items, right? It always turns out to be the little Chad. Or whatever it's called. I'm not sure actually. We'll try it. Because why not? Oh, you can. Hmm. I mean, what, what other choice we have? Evil Up. That, I think, increases your chance of a devil deal, right? Not sure if it affects anything after you've been hit. Whatever. 
Looks like coin wise, I'm not gonna have enough. No chance. But I mean, surprisingly, considering how long I've not played this game, I feel like I'm doing okay so far. Haven't had any, you know, major fuck ups. But there's always next floor. If I can maintain these three spirit hearts, well, one and a half spirit hearts, and get a devil deal. I forgot to pick up the bombs. I was like, I knew you, the um, matchbook or whatever, matchsticks, is supposed to drop bombs. I was like, where the fuck are they? I just didn't pick them up. Dead friend. Uh, Liberty Cap. The Liberty Cap has okay effects. I'll take Liberty Cap. This fish head didn't do shit for me so far. I cannot believe that's how I lost it. I remember now. This is where fucking Samson's ball and chain become a disadvantage. I forgot about the stink mushrooms. Or fart mushrooms or whatever. Mom's razor. That's another protection item. Or orbital. Has the... To use the exact terminology, we can also go in here. See what we have. Black candle. I'll take black candle. If nothing else for the evil up. The spirit heart, of course, because I'm taking a lot of damage. More damage than I would like. Oh, nice. Curved horn. Much appreciated. It's actually a significant damage up. Oh, hollow. Finally a boss where got an angel room. Sacred I don't know what this is. Homing shots and damage up. I think that's a good item, right? Isn't that thing super rare, Binky? I seem to remember that item being like super rare, isn't it? Oh hopefully it is what it is. Because if so, holy shit, it does actually home quite a bit. I wonder if you can, does this destroy rocks automatically or can you, no you can, okay. You can play around with it. I don't know why I'm going around here, there ain't gonna be shit on this floor anyways. At this point. Weird. I hate those. I hate <laughs> I hate those fucking spike floors. Alright, we'll kind of explore just a little bit more. See what we can find. Nice. Ooh. Man, actually. This is turning out to be a fairly solid run. Like looking at my stats and the floor whoa. Yeah, this thing is super OP, isn't it? The burning heart or sacred heart or whatever. Hey, we got an OP item. Now, the thing is, a lot of times I get OP damage up items in this game. And I lose them just by getting hit a shit ton. So if we can avoid that, that would be, you know, fantastic. We still got a long way to go. Okay, that's holy fuck. This item is pretty good. So I'm just wiping the floors or with enemies. Holy shit. Okay, I'm not gonna risk it here. I'll go on duty. Yep. What is this item? I've never had it before. Or if I've have if I have had it, I forgot. This is fat protector, right? Yes. Okay, these orbitals are Awesome, because I feel like I'm very well protected at this point. 
This is my dog, by the way, barking, if you hear that. I don't know how much you can hear that. Keys. Give me all the keys you can give. So this is when this game turns really fun. When you're overpowered as shit. That's when this game is like... You know, damn. Of course, one green bloat, or whatever that boss is called, just bloat, I think. The green variation, and it can all go to shit, so... We gots to be careful. And this game is really fun. Sometimes, I think I mentioned this, I feel like this game is best in a streamed format, actually. But, you know, streaming off of PC is not my strong suit. Let's go in here. Okay. This is... This ain't even fair. I'm gonna be honest with you, this ain't even fair. Like, the amount of annihilation I'm putting out is... kind of insane. Now, the only question here is what ending we should go for. I think I'll just take a standard, uh, something like chest. You know, I haven't played the game in ages, so... No reason to overcomplicate anything. Alright. Oh, wait, yeah. I forgot I didn't take out the boss yet. Oh, this, this is cheating. Just HP up. I'll take that. I'll take that. No devil or angel, even though I didn't take jack shit for damage. Although, it's pretty much giving me all the items I can want. I can, I can ever want. The boy is pretty... Oh, the missing poster. What do you need that for? It's like needed for an ending, right? What is the missing poster? Oh no, it's needed for the lost, but you need to start with it, right? Or something. I don't remember. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't have the lost unlocked. Or do I have the lost on? This is how much I know. <laughs> Shows you my Isaac knowledge and how long it's been since I've played. Right, let's get the item. I almost ran into... I think this is the mom boss fight at this point, right? I can't believe... One thing I do remember is that this is an extremely rare item, right? So... Ouch. Well... These types of rooms are the ones that could screw me. Curse of Darkness on something, you know. Oh, fuck off. I didn't mean to do that. Actually, you know what? I don't have any keys. Well, or, or, I mean, I have plenty of keys, so... What do you mean I don't have any keys? I'm talking, talking out of my ass. He didn't even get to chan a chance to spawn. Poor dude. What the homing? When this, how does this thing have way better homing than pretty much any other item? Book of Anarchy or Anarchist Cookbook. I will. Very gladly skip on that. This is why I like having runs like this, where you get a bad item and it's like, eh, whatever. Would be great to get that. Wait, where the hell is the shop? Oh, yeah, there it is, up there. Would have been great to get that battery and re-roll, but hey. What can you do at this point? Uh, we'll take a spirit. Might as well charge our HP up as much as we can. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, game. Very much appreciated. This ain't even... F this ain't even fair. Let me just tell you that. This ain't even... Fair. What order should we go in? Let's check the angel room. Holy chalice... Yeah, I knew that was something good. Let's check this, because we have... Uh, <laughs> butter bean. Gives me fucking butter bean. Yeah, fuck it, we'll go with the Polaroid. It's a standard one. If I can get to Blue Baby, I might do that as well. I feel like this run... We could have a possible Blue Baby. Without any obstacles, because... We are powerful enough, I think. Oh, shit. Shouldn't have done that. That was a mistake. I ran into it. 
Because I could have gotten two charges. Oh, I have flight now. That's actually good because this... This floor is full of like annoying... Uh, like blood stains or whatever they're called. Creep. Especially if you get Curse of the Darkness. Uh, it actually gets really difficult to tell what you're stepping on. So having some extra backup never hurt anybody. Okay, we'll keep that around. Let's not forget about that, because it's exactly the type of shit I tend to forget about. Uh, so I'm making a mental note, you know. Ooh, oh, I hate that. That's the one thing, these exploding... Uh, whatever's those can screw me over just, just the risk of Samson's ball and chain I guess overall though this item has helped wait is this an XL floor huh I didn't even notice wait what card even is this it's healing I'll keep that I didn't know I wasn't even paying attention to what the hell it was Mom's stiletto. Well, that's gonna be a hard reroll because. <laughs> Wait. Like, what am I gonna. Wait, no. Why did I think this was an XL floor? I just accidentally pressed Q. I'm stupid. GG's, Mr. Sketchhead. GG's. You just play yourself. You accidentally pressed the Q key and you fucked up. Whatever. I mean. This don't look like a run where I'm gonna be like starred for healing items. Uh, just like... Judging by this... Judging by what's happening on screen, doesn't exactly look like it. Basic fact that I'm like... Pressing a direction, I'm shooting and things are just ending up dead, left and right, so... Uh, yeah. I'm actually getting quite a few of those re-rolls. Not that we'll be able to really capitalize. We will be able to capitalize if we go blue baby. It's so good. This item is so good. Man, thank fuck for angel rooms. Actually, the fact that, you know, the best thing that could have happened on this run is that I missed out on the devil deal. Because, I mean, just look at this shit. Just look at it. It ain't even fair. It ain't even fair to the other... <laughs> I just just died. Okay, I, I didn't even... S At first I didn't even see what the hell that was. I like these types of Isaac runs, you know. These are the type of runs that, you know, really fire you up to play this game. It just curves around. I'm like so well protected by these orbitals as well. Cool. Let's take a look. What is that? Angelic prism. You have got to be shitting me. I know what this is. I remember this item. This is like horribly OV, OP. OV. OV 040. Yeah, we're going. Azul baby. First of all, because the theme is awesome. But second of all... Is that, that's synthol. It's adrenaline. Never mind. Well, goat head is a little too late. Bomb sack, I guess we can take. I guess we'll take goat head as well, I mean... Ain't gonna do shit. I might as well take the Robo Baby, right? This is the 2.0. Oh no, it's not. It's the 1.0. Uh, let's donate. We had the car battery as well. Just in case we're not horribly OP enough. Okay. Got just enough. I feel good about this. What is this? Extra pill room. 
Thanks, but no thanks. We'll get, we'll take it, but it's like whatever. So, so as soon as this prism activates, it's gonna be like the end for him. Yeah, because it's like shots go through it, and I think the amount of damage it can deal is like insane, especially with a static boss. I'm gonna try maximizing, you know, the the potential here. This thing still has insane amounts of HP. It, it, does he have the highest? I don't know with Delirium. Delirium might have higher HP now. Thank you, Into the Breach. Or, I mean, Enter the Gungeon. I didn't think of Into the Breach. It's another indie game. I could, probably because I just played it. Thank you, Enter the Gungeon, for making me better with Bullet Hell games. If there is a bullet hell game, that's a bullet hell game. How the hell did that hit? I mean, the homing does help. They only have to pay attention to my shooting. And why do these flies have so much HP? I can use these, can't I? Homing bombs. Look at this avoidance as I'm getting hit. It's all good though. What the? Oh, the, it's. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, Prism. Come to my aid. See, I mean, this boss is still difficult. Everybody knows that. It's just a lot easier than in most other attempts. Normally this is always a butt clench, this boss, but here I'm, I'm not too worried. I'm gonna be honest with you. Of course I've killed him with Isaac before, so it's not like I'm unlocking anything. Uh, what exactly is going on, boys? Or does he just like, okay, does he just do that? I guess he just does that. I could could get some HP back. Come on. If he kills me, I just realized I might die. My own mortality, I've been confronted with it. And I'm not happy about it. Oh, where is a blank when you need one? Just fucking die. Thank you. You gotta be kidding me. This boss is a lot of HP. So I could continue. Oh fuck, I'm forced to continue, right? Because of goddamn. Because mm, I already unlocked all this shit. Well, I guess we're continuing, boys, with 3 HP, so the, I guess this will not be a successful run. Why did I think you could end with... Uh, why can't you end with... what's his name? Hush. I thought that gave you the ending, if you... Or whatever, I mean, technically we've conquered the hardest obstacle. The harder obstacle is that I'm... That I don't have jack shit for HP. But a... Something dropped. I heard something dropping. Strange. So again, like... All we need is a... Few spirit hearts or... Take rat hearts as well. Whatever the game got, it can give. Of course. 
That was accidental. I, well, I wanted to pick that up, but whatever. Oh, how dead am I? Incredibly dead. Maybe not. Fuck. I am. I'm the deadest I could possibly be. Come on. Okay, dead. Maybe. Just maybe. We can make it. Really gonna depend on what these items are. I have one missing key. But this is really gotta... It ain't it. Tech zero. Hold on. Wait, wasn't that tech zero? Wait, this might work out. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. We are not doing too badly here in terms of our damage. This juicy sack is gonna piss me off because it's such an annoying item because it leaves the creep. Making things actually more difficult to see. I mean, in terms of just like pure annihilation, we're doing okay. Bob's head, fuck that. Oh, I have, I have a reroll. What am I doing? Did you see that barrage of bullets? Which means... Keep forgetting I have my re-roll. That's even worse. Not taking such a high risk item and this amount of HP. Oh, fuck you. Homing fucking brimstone. Everybody's favorite. This is just gonna be a wipe. <laughs> I knew it. Just melted. So yeah, this is not the issue here. Like, blue baby. I feel like... I feel like we're standing our ground here. Okay, just keep giving me hearts. I think we got a good deal going on here. This goddamn boss. No. I was just about to say, this goddamn boss and his slides always get me. And he charged into me and I immediately died. Yeah, reusable bomb. That's a, that's a hard pass. I don't know what that is. I'm afraid of Libra. Which, you know equalizes your stats and that would be a big oof the plinking shears are good though it's a good damage dealing item just like you know activate it and holy shit with spiders plinking shears yes we won i cannot believe it actually i can believe it because that was a horribly op run uh 33 minutes very succinct episode of Binding of Isaac. It's actually one of the first successful runs I've had uh, well, in my like past uploads. I've uploaded Isaac a couple of months ago. Probably more than a couple of months ago. And those weren't, those weren't it, Chief. But this, this was it, Chief. This was a very good run. So hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Binding of Isaac. When the game is like this, RNG Jesus is on your side. This game is very fun. It's always fun, but you know, it's more fun like this. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here. Uh, make sure to stick around this week for other videos as well. We'll be playing more or I'll be playing more indie games. So for now, thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe and all that. And I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.